Yeah, what's going on, y'all? Side Pod King Carter here, the Superman of YouTube. It's time to go up against the Knicks, man. I know y'all been waiting for this semifinals. It's here, man. The stat sheet stuffer is back for y'all. Let's go. Hit me on the short point and I'ma make it rain. rain. Second dude to score 100 points in the game. game. Some call it jump shot. I call it fire starter. The ball threw me a oop. They thought I was Vince Carter. Put me on the court. And I'ma make it rain, rain. Second dude to score 100 points in the game. game Some call it jump shot, I call it fire starter Ball through me a oop, they thought I was Vince Carter The next stage of the Eastern Conference playoff battle begins here Game 1 of the Conference Semifinals Both these teams have survived and moved one step closer to the title With Steve Kerr and Clark Keller, this is Kevin Hart He'll be facing off against Carmelo Anthony. What an efficient scorer is Anthony. He can put points on the board inside and outside, and he's aggressive at taking the ball to the basket and loves to get to that foul line. He's a tough player to try to guard. And now, State Farm presents our starting lineup for Game 1 in the conference semifinals. First for the Knicks, Davis is out there with Landry Fields. Tyson Chandler, the big man in the middle. He's a big part of that presence down low. Then it's Anthony. And it's Stoudemire and at the power forward. And for the Wizards, John Wall and Nick Young are the back. And the man in the middle, JaVale McGee. They look to him to provide that necessary presence down low. And it's Blotch in at the four spot. Guys, win after win, they have been utterly dominant in the postseason. One sweep after another. Year. Did y'all catch that delay by the commentators, man? They was talking about the Knicks while they were showing the Wizards. Also, they didn't even say my name. I thought this mode was my player. But first possession of the game, you already know what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to cut to the basket for the alley-oop, but he wasn't biting. So you already know what I'm about to do. Back him down. Show Melo who's the man in the post. Get used, Melo. Check out that advanced post move right there. Ew. Now coming out, I wanted to shoot the jump shot, but... I knew that I wasn't going to make it. I still need to work on my jump shot. So I'm going to work with my teammates on this one. JaVel McGee, get to the basket. Get to the hole and use Stoudemire. That's what it's all about. We getting in the paint this game. It's not too many jump shots that we can really shoot. We don't really have pure jump shooters. So we work in the paint. I use my teammates on picks just to dunk on people's heads. Now, I turned on cutscenes, so a lot of my dunks won't be showing slam cams that much. But you know I got to pull out a few special dunks for y'all to get that slam cam. Let's see what I can do here. Check out this pass. I don't even know what I was doing, but I still hit the jump shot. It's cash, by the way. We going down the court. Now, John Wall, he never likes to take my picks, man. He never drives to the basket. I give this guy probably three picks a play. But every time I set a pick, it seems like he don't want to use it. But check me going in with the acrobatic layup. I got fouled, no call. The refs don't love me, man. But check out the alley you. As soon as we come down the court, I don't even need to set picks no more. I tell Jay Wall, yo, I'm going to go get it. So he passes it to me every time. Now, check out this defense right here. I was trying to steal the ball, but obviously things ain't go that way. But check me out. Look at how I got eyes in the back of my head. I seen my teammate. Usually people just go in and get fouled, but the refs ain't calling calls for me. So I'm just doing things a little bit different. Check me out putting on the dribble moves. Putting Melo back in the post. Oh, Melo, get used. Come on, Melo. I got you at a standstill. Baby, you good? <laughs> All right, the New York Knicks is up one, but I got something to say about that. Check me out going in with another acrobatic layup. The refs ain't calling nothing for me, man. I thought this was Dunkington, D.C. I guess me going in for layups don't count. <laughs> but check out the steal by my boy Nick Young. I'm going in for the dunk. I don't know what happened to my dunk package right there. I had the Jay Smith package. I don't know why I went in for that little running dunk. Maybe I got to check my package after this game. But you know the alley-oops is there. Stop playing. I got my vertical up now. I'm catching alley-oops on demand. <laughs> you might have to get DVR for this one. I'm just saying. But check out Balkman going in, getting blocked out of his mind. 
You see me on a break. You see I got them nice Jamal Crawford package, baby. Shake and bake. Stop playing. Got that shake and bake package, man. It's only 500K, so you know I had to grab it. I didn't want to be cheap about it. But check out my man Andre Blatch giving me the alley-oop. He already knew one nobody going to be able to jump. They already under the rim. <laughs> it was just a matter of me cutting to the basket at the right time. Look at that. Automatic poster. But check out my boy Blatch hitting me with another screen. So you know I had to feed him, man. He been abusing Stoudemire all game long. Look at him get hype. Come on, stop playing. Stop playing. Let's get hype in Dunkington, baby. We down two, though. It's all good. I got, I got faith in my teammates always, man. Especially in Washington because they didn't kill my roster like how I have it with my PG. So everything is real copacetic with mine. But we're about to get into the halftime show, y'all. Let's go. It's HP at the half. Round two of the playoffs is getting started. Let's catch up to the action. The Knicks are taking care of business. They're looking to make a statement in game one and set the tone for the series. Carmelo Anthony has had himself an amazing start. Seems like everything's falling for him. Not sure if he even knows how to miss. And a scrappy effort by Washington. A huge advantage in points in the paint. They're having their way inside. JaVel McGee has been the X Factor. He's got eight points, and the defense has been rock solid. A couple guys right here you want to lead the charge for the teams as we move on to the second half. And back to Washington we go. Thanks so much for being with us. All right, after my coach finally subbed me in and gave me a little bit more playing time, I wanted to get my dribble game on. You see me going up in with the nice contact layup. The ref's still not giving me nothing, but it's all good. I'm here to play. You know, in the NBA, it's a lot of people out there flopping. So I'm guessing the refs is tired of it, <laughs> you know, this time around. They said, hey, man, we in the playoffs. Let's stop this whistle calling. But check out my boy John Wall going in with the layup. I usually don't give John Wall too many passes because he's never cut it. Maybe, you know, he's been listening to me in the locker room lately. But check me out with the nice little rolling of the ball. You know, I usually don't get to do that too much. <laughs> But check this out, man. I'm going to show y'all how y'all do it, man. Let my boy Jay Wall come down. Cut to the basket. Get the alley you. <laughs> Stop pinning. Let's go. Look at this. Ew. Mm -mm -mm. Wait till I start doing 360 alley-oops and off-the-backboard joints. I'm going to be the man in Washington, man. But check me out using B. Diddy in the post. Stop putting people on the switch, man. Melo, come stick me. That's that's a little letter to you, Melo. Yeah, don't don't shrug me by my yo. What's up? I see you looking at me, fam. Don't bump my yo. Real talk, man. Wait till I make this free throw, man. It's cool we down. I know y'all up. It's all good. I ain't worried about that. But but yeah, man. It seems like Melo is always spazzing, yo. Like every time me and him go up against each other, head up. It's crazy. But check me out with the contact dunk. I finally get a foul. We in Dunkington, so I guess it took a dunk for the ref to actually call a foul. But I no need to show you the free throw real quick. We coming down, man. We on a get back. You know, it's hard out here, but you could you see I couldn't cut to the basket. They stopped all of that. But check me going in for another contact dunk. This time, I, I think I scared B. Diddy. <laughs> Look at the way B. Diddy. He was like, no, please. Don't dunk on me. I don't deserve this. That's what you get for switching, man. But check out Stoudemire going in, missing the layup. You see McGee hitting me. I'm dribbling. Oh, almost missed it. But you see the cutter? Yo, I'm telling you, man. For some reason, my passing game has been getting up there lately, man. I have I have been throwing less turnovers. It's been looking good. The only time I really get turnovers nowadays is when I'm dribbling and the ball bounces off somebody's foot. I call that a, a kick violation in my book. But check me out shooting the three. It's cash, by the way. You know, check getting a clap on. Yo, I'm loving the cutscenes. I think I'm going to have to, you know, keep my cutscenes on. You see me try to cut to the rim for the alley off the inbound, but I was like, nah, I can't make that one. I ain't that nice. But check out McGee going to the basket. He's showing off. He is showing off. We finally take the lead. We up three, and I get a, I get a foul. Yeah. With nine minutes left, I get a foul. So now this is the only thing I have to worry about. I got five turnovers, right? I'm probably not going to get back in the game. So I got to believe in my team that they can win. Usually... People will say, fuck. They be sweating their asses off saying, oh, my God, I swear to God, if my team don't win this game. But I got faith in my team. And since I got my auto saved on, either way, I'm assed out, right? <laughs> so my team looks like they're going to take the win. But let's see what New York got in the last final seconds. Uh-oh. Uh oh, it's getting closer. Oh, no, we got this one. 
Oh yeah, it's over, guys. It is over. Let's go, Washington. And so it's the Wizards with the W. It was a solid win, Clark. Yeah, it was, and I think it came down to will more than skill. They went out and got this one. That'll do it for now for Clark Kellogg, Steve Kerr, Doris Burke, Kevin Harlan saying thanks for tuning in to the NBA Eastern Conference semifinals presented by 2K Sports. Now, Jordan presents the player of the game. Get me on the court, and I'm going to make it rain. rain. Second dude to score 100 points in the game. game. Some call it jump shot. shot. I call it fire starter. The ball threw me a oop. They thought I was Vince Carter. Put me on the court, and I'm going to make it rain. rain. Second dude to score 100 points in the game. game. Some call it jump shot. I call it fire starter. The ball threw me a oop. They thought I was Vince Carter. Yo, I go and get it if you throw the alley oop. Leave me wide open, I won't hesitate to shoot. They call me Stat Stuffer, I put points on the scoreboard. So much swag, my Lamborghini need four doors. Give me the ball and I perform like Mike. The greatest of all time, I get all that hype. I'm skipping the Kobe Bryant, I'm skipping LeBron James. Give me the ball, yo, I'm creative in all lanes. And when you get the ball, I take cookies I got vets looking like they mini camp rookies I bank it off glass, I run a break fast I penetrate pass, my jump shot cash So the D, they better get their hand up I got the coach screaming, telling y'all man up And put a double team on 87 Carter The rookie of the year that's taking the Wizards farther Make it rain. rain. Second dude to score 100 points in the game. game. Some call it jump shot. shot. I call it fire starter. The ball threw me a oop. They thought I was Vince Carter. Put me on the court and I'ma make it rain. rain. Second dude to score 100 points in the game. game. Some call it jump shot. I call it fire starter. The ball threw me a oop. They thought I was Vince Carter. Carter. You guys go up 1-0 with the win tonight, getting things off on the right foot in this series. How do you capitalize on that moving forward to game two? It's good to get a win in that first game. I know we definitely felt the pressure to get it done and not have to play from behind. When you start any series out with a win, it gives you that much extra confidence moving forward. I think we just need to do everything we can to carry that forward to game two. Thanks for watching, you guys. This is IKC signing out. Peace.